Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. This one, we're in Suno, and in particular, we're going to be taking a look at the brand new version 4. We're taking it for a test drive, and according to them, it creates crisper audio, better lyrics, and more creative song structures. I am hyped to try it. Now, the first thing you'll see here is I am on their website. I will put a link in the description below. However, I am not signed in yet. So I'm just going to go down here to the left side. And I'm going to click on sign in so you guys can see the whole process here. I'm going to use my Google account. And here we go. So let's go ahead and sign in with my Curtis at kingy.ai account. And now, presto, boom. We're logged in, and now this is what you should be seeing. So let's take a quick look and a couple of listens to a few different songs. Then we're going to dig into creating them, and we're going to go through it step by step. All right, so now before we dig into creating our own music, I like to take a look at what other people are doing here. And Suno has done a great job showing off their goods here. So you can see here up at the top, Fresh from V4. This is the brand new model they just released, and apparently it's really, really good. We're going to listen to a few songs. If you want to see what's trending around the world, they've got it nicely curated here for you. Follow some of the more popular personas, I suppose, the people that are creating content. So you've got cool things like playlists. You can go ahead and follow people. You can even look through things by category if you're so inclined. Let's go ahead and look at Fresh from V4. I'm going to look at this pretty girl here and see what it says here. Let's take a look at this one. Yeah. Brody. Okay, let's go. Whoa. Young summer days on my mind when we were freckle kissed a thousand times, freckle kissed a thousand times, freckle kissed a thousand times. Well, that's actually way better than I expected because that's all AI. That sounds like a real person singing. Holy smokes, what the hell? V4 is a big upgrade as far as I can tell here. Let's take a look over here. You can see on the right side here, it says Freckle Kissed. You can see the different styles, Tropical House, Lo-Fi, Trance, Electronic, Blues, etc. Here are the lyrics. If you want to follow Brody, the person who made it, just click on that little button here. Here's the verses, verses, chorus. Wow, impressive stuff, guys. So, I mean, go ahead and flip through some of these. I mean, I'm not sure. What do they got? Uh, let's see if there are any of these, like, kind of stick out for me. Uh, freckle kissed. No, that's generally not how I roll. Summer rain. No, song for spaghetti. There's a song about spaghetti. I like spaghetti. Let's go. Let's take a quick listen here. Where's the spaghetti? <laughs> All right, I don't even know what that is, but I like it. But you can hear the quality, guys. Pretty cool stuff. So there we go. There's just a couple of quick listens. Now let's start creating. I'm going to click on the Create button here on the left side. There are two styles. I'm going to walk you through both of them. However, before I do that, I want to bring you a message from today's sponsor, Wondershare Recover It. Losing an important file at the worst possible time is an awful feeling. We've all been in the situation before, whether by deleting a file by accident, formatting gone wrong, or dealing with a system crash. When that important file disappears, you'll literally do anything to get it back. Wondershare Recover It's advanced scanning technology can find your lost files no matter where they are. Whether it's an Excel spreadsheet, PowerPoint presentation, or a Word doc, Recover It can find it and bring it back to life. All you have to do is point and click and Recover It will do the rest. Let's say I accidentally deleted an important photo from my hard drive and emptied the recycle bin. Just fire up Recover It and start with the location where the file was last seen. In this case, I'm gonna come over to D Drive and then School Project. Wondershare is gonna start doing its thing. And just like that, it found the picture in no time at all. It's recommended to save the file in a different location than it was previously. So I'm gonna save it in my C drive. The file's gonna pop up right here, and just like that, your file is back to life. Don't let lost files stress you out. Trusted by over 100 million users worldwide and backed by 20 years of expertise in data recovery, secure, reliable, powerful recovery for any device, only with Recoverit. Try Recoverit today. 
All right, so let's go ahead and cook with Suno version 4, the brand new one. We're going to give it a test drive. All right, so up at the top left here, you'll see custom. There is a toggle. So for those of you that want to, you know, put more inputs in, maybe you're a little bit more of an advanced uh, AI audio generator or AI song creator, go ahead and turn on custom. I'm going to turn it off to start, and then we're going to look at the customs in a few seconds here, the custom options that is. So here we go. It's turned off. We're going to go ahead and select version 4. This is the newest one. It's in beta, but it has great quality, as we just heard. And then here we go. Song description. I'm going to go a song about a bulldog that doesn't listen to anyone. That is very much my dog. I'll turn caps off. off. My bad. <laughs> and then we have another option here. Do we want lyrics or no lyrics? If we want just instruments, no lyrics, you're doing a dance track or something like that, go ahead and turn this toggle on. I'm going to leave it off because I want some lyrics. And then here we go. Remy, R-E-M-I. This is the newest creative model. And it's in beta, but we can go ahead and access it. So I am going to use that. But do keep in mind there is a classic model as well if you are so inclined. Now, all you need to do in the basic non-custom model is simply click on Create. And it is going to cook. And it is cooking up two of them for you. Keep in mind now, we get 50 credits a day. And apparently... 50 credits kind of computes out to about 10 free songs per day. And you can already see that it's going ahead. It's created the thumbnail. It's generating the songs. It might take a few seconds. I'm going to come back when this is done. We're going to listen to it, and then we're going to go into the non into the custom mode where we can, yeah, we can do a little bit more with these, uh, with these songs. All right, welcome back. So it's gone ahead and done up two versions of this song for us. So let's go ahead and listen to it. I'm going to listen to the first one here up at the top. Let's go. All right. I'm digging it. Right side, you'll see the lyrics. Nothing's going to make my bulldog listen. Fussy, wanting my attention. So good. And now he's on my shoulder, barking at everything I want to pedal to the metal. 24 years I try to take the same direction. Wow, guys, that is amazing. We just put in a couple of words and hit the go button. We hit create, and it came up with an incredible sounding song. Even the, the lyrics sound good. What the hell? This is really amazing. Okay, let's check out the second version here, version four. But uh, it's the second one. Mm, country. Okay, good music. Nothing's gonna make my bulldog listen. Front seat wants my attention. And now he's Holy. on my shoulder. Barking at everything I want. Pedal to the metal. 24 years I try to take the same direction. Guys, that is amazing. Holy smokes, has AI music come a long way? Suno version 4, you are a scary bunch of business. Wow. And you know what? We can make some more changes here. So, I mean, let's just go through a few of them here. So, you can see here, you can make this song public if I want people to hear it. Like, this one here is really good. So, I would turn that on. If I want to extend it, I want to make it a little longer. Right now, it's 3 minutes and 41 seconds, which I should note is a length of a full song. So, you're not getting, like, little snippets. You're getting... Full songs, absolutely wild. So, but if we wanted to extend it, we could go ahead and do that. We can copy it. You can also see here when you click on these three dots or the little ellipses upside down, so to speak. Look at this here. We can extend. We can reuse the prompt. We could do a cover song. These are the pro stuff. We I don't have a pro version right now, although this could make me get one. Add it to a playlist, move it to a workspace. Maybe you had like a workspace, like a country workspace, and then you've got one for something else. I mean, you could go ahead and do that. And like I said, visibility so people can see it. We can share it, download it. Look, oh, wow, we can download the video too. Okay, that's cool. Let's download the audio. All right, so we've got the song. So now I've got that song. Guys, and if we want to go over here, check this out. We can go ahead and edit. So look at this here. We can go ahead and song details. We can change the name of the song. We can even go in and manually change the lyrics. So nothing from seat wanting my attention. 
and then I can just type something in here, dad, and then I can change the lyrics. Absolutely crazy, guys. This is amazing. But hey, you know what? We haven't even looked at the custom side of things. So now this is awesome. Let's look at custom next. All right, so now let's go ahead and look at the custom side of things. Actually, right before I do that, just one last thing. I'm gonna click on this explore here and check this out. This is fantastic. I've never seen anything like this, but it's got this sort of moving wheel where you can click on any of these different types of songs or styles and sort of just sort of listen to them and get a feel for them, like Ilbient Egyptian. I don't know what the heck that is. Let's click on it. Just listen for one second here. All right. Ilbient Egyptian. I like this because you can try out so many different new styles and ideas, and you can just swing through it here by moving the mouse and try out and listen to things that you would have never known about. Like, I don't even know what any of these are, basically. So something cool to think about if you're not sure or you're looking for ideas, go ahead and try that out. Now, let's go ahead and keep on moving forward. So I'm going to click on Create. Now we're going to do the custom version. So custom off, which is what we just did. Now we're going to go into custom. And when you do that, you'll also see here there's an upload audio. If I click on that here, watch this. You can upload your own song, your own beats, your own lyrics, whatever you've got, as long as it's your stuff and you're willing to agree to their terms. Because you can't basically, you can't take like a Drake song and say, hey, that's mine and just use it. Because then you can get in a little bit of trouble, I assume. So you can upload your own audio awesome stuff. Also, let's go ahead and move down a bit here. You can write lyrics here. Now, in the basic version, it would write the whole song for you, or you could just write the full song. But look at this here. If you want to go ahead and write this line by line, look at that here. Write a thoughtful chorus. Enter some text. French Bulldog that listens very poorly. Oops. Let's see if I can spell poorly. There we go. Something like that. Save the changes. Okay, so we would write this line by line. Absolutely crazy. I love it here. Let's keep going down a little bit here. Let's go to styles of music. Okay, we don't want to exclude any styles, but what kind of styles do we want? Now, I'm just going to quickly scroll through here. They've got a whole bunch down here at the bottom. Electronic core. I like that idea. Let's do with, uh, what's dark synth? I like that too. You see, I'm just adding them in. I'm just clicking the button here and it's just adding them in. So it's nice and simple like that. If I wanted to add in my own, like manually, I could go metal, I could go um, uh, thrash, I don't know, whatever the hell I wanna put in there, just go ahead and do that. Uh, Persona is in beta where you can copy the voice and the styles of a song that you've already created. I'm not gonna go ahead and do that, but I do want you to know that that's available. We can enter a title, we're gonna call this Bad Doggo. All right, having some fun here. We're gonna go ahead and put it in my workspace. If I wanna create a new workspace, I can go ahead and do that. And I'm gonna click on the Create button, and it's gonna go ahead and cook this up for me. I'm gonna come back when this is done, show you what we got, and then we're gonna wrap this all up. All right, welcome back. So let's see what we got here. It's called Bad Doggo, just like I asked it for. Electronic or dark synth, metal, thrash. Let's listen in. We wrote it line by line, so there's only one line so far. Again, this is an option. You can go ahead and write a full song, or you can have Suno write it for you, which is also very cool. But let's just listen to this to see what the, the sound's like here. Here we go. First one, Bad Doggo. Christ, yeah. Wow. Damn. All right, I'm liking it. That's heavy. <laughs> With some electronic gore and the synth in there. Plus the heavy metal. Okay, listen to the last second one here uh, real quickly as well. All right. Make this public. <laughs> what? All right, that is amazing, guys. And I mean, literally, the prompt was like, literally, it's six words and you get full songs out of it with incredible quality. The vo the lyrics sound like 
like a real person is singing them. I mean, this V4 is absolutely stunning. And again, we've only just touched the surface. You can go in and extend them. We could have it write a whole new song from scratch. Absolutely wild, guys. This is Suno version 4. It's amazing. You got to give it a try. You get like 10 free songs a day, so you can't go wrong. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching.